I was in a restaurant recently looking through the wine list and they had photos of feature bottles of wine. Now the photos were average in quality so they didn't really excite me enough to try those wines. So let me show you what goes into a great wine bottle photo. So today we're in the studio, we're photographing two bottles of wine for Castelli wines and there's two parts to the shoot. There's first part is white background type shots, perfect for your website. Uh, magazine articles or for restaurants, any supplier that may want your bottle images. The second part of the shoot is more creative. So we want to actually get a nice juicy photo of this label or this bottle actually on like a warm rich background which will just look awesome. This will be great for like an Instagram pic or an email newsletter or any kind of promotional material promoting that wine. So there's three factors we're fanatical about when photographing your wine. The first thing is the label. Particularly this label here, there's two important things that we need to be technically aware of. First of all is this gold foiling. Depending on what lighting we use and what diffusion we use, this can either look really good or not so good. So it's important that the gold looks you know, nice and shiny and, and true to life. The second thing is this little spot laminate decal on the side here. Again, same as the gold foiling, it really needs to be lit right so it gives the right amount of shine and, and goodness and, and brings out just enough detail in that there. And so it's really important to get the label looking, you know, schmick because you spend a lot of time and effort into that design. The next factor is the bottle, the actual outside of the bottle. So we want to show that it's, it's shiny, like so bottles are round and reflective. So the last thing we want to do is make it look like some photographers just stuck a couple of lights there and lit the bottle. So we really need to pay careful attention to how those lights reflect in the bottle. So we want your bottle to look shiny, but still hold its shape and be nice and round. And the third thing is actually the inside of the bottle. So your wine, and how much light we see through the bottle, how vibrant, how bright, how fresh the wine looks. And this will depend uh, based on the color of, of the wine, obviously red wines, it's gonna be a black bottle. Um, but the lighter the wine goes, then we really want to pay attention to how that looks in the photo so it's, um, it's enticing and it's true to life. And when it comes to the creative shots, there's really no rules, no format you need to follow. The photos just need to look good, they need to get people excited enough to try your wine.